Genesis System Group manufactures work cells with uh, robotic arms. We are primarily a welding group and have ventured out in the last two years into the aerospace world in the ultrasonic inspection of carbon fiber parts as well as the water jet cutting of carbon fiber materials. The end of arm tool or the end effector is the device that we mount to the end of the robot to be able to pick up a part or weld parts together with. About 18 months ago, Genesis developed a water jet cutting cell that we in-house call our razor jet system. We developed a end of arm tool out of the FDM material to pick up a customer part. Once we pick that up, we're able to take that underneath the water jet and cut the part with the water jet while holding it with the FDM gripper. So when we started the development, we, uh, we wanted uh, an end of arm tool that was vacuum, that was quick, cheap, easy, and durable and repeatable enough for the water jet application. So our designer worked with Stratasys to develop this end of arm tool that has a port all the way through for vacuum. It provided uh, an easy, quick way for us to pick the part and take it to the water jet. So this design allowed us to incorporate a vacuum and we didn't have to use any outside tubing to be able to create the vacuum within the part. Um, all we had to do is add a PEOP suction cup and uh, it easily created a process that otherwise we would have to, to use a lot of um, outside vacuum tubing and uh, it, would, it would probably be damaged by the processes in which we were running parts through. Normally it would take weeks to get parts manufactured or made. With the FDM gripper you can have a new end of arm complete and bolted up to the robot within, uh, within a day or so. So there's quite a bit of cost savings as well as time savings. In comparing the durability of the FDM parts to the traditional grippers that we use, the FDM parts hold up in the inspection world just as well as the traditional manufactured grippers. The water jet is a much harsher environment, uh, but we're still able to get the cycles that we need out of that FDM gripper. With the use of the FDM material, it allows our designers to think outside of the box a little bit more and produce something that's specific for the application versus having to design around the manufacturing environment. It, it allows quite a bit of flexibility for them to be able to do that. It's a more enjoyable process. It's, I get to design um, parts that are more organic. I don't have to work with block material. The FDM parts have allowed Genesis to provide a unique service to the customer that not all of the integrators that they deal with would normally have. They have the ability to now print and manufacture these things quickly versus the traditional approach of manufacturing, machining, and assembling all of the end-of-arm tools for their robotics.